All right, so let's have a look at cloning by nuclear transfer. So cloning by nuclear transfer is the cloning of um, adults. Yeah. Um, this is not the cloning of embryos. And this is the cloning of somatic cells. Okay. A somatic cell is anything that is not a sperm egg, not a gamete. Okay. So it's an adult cell. So diploid. So it's definitely, as you said, a diploid cell. And this okay. is a diploid cell, which is 2N. Yeah. Now, this is all about the restoration of cells to a totipotent state. Okay. And totipotent means that that cell is able to produce an entire new individual. Okay. So, the example that I could give you is that you, because you're a girl, we could take a cell from your fingertip. Yeah. We have to take that single cell and we take the nucleus out of that single cell. And then we need to take an egg. And then egg, remember, is going to be haploid. Now we're going to then take out that nucleus and we're going to put in the 2N nucleus from Me. your somatic diploid okay. cell. We then need to stimulate it to so give it a little zap of electricity. Now what you've put it into is you, you put it into an egg without a nucleus. Yeah. So obviously you're not going to fertilise this, you give it a zap of electricity, which is a bit like the jolt it gets when it gets fertilised. Okay. And then you can put it into the uh, a surrogate. Okay. Or, alternatively, being a bit weirder, you could put it into yourself. Okay. <laughs> and then, nine months time, you could give birth to you, your identical twin. So this would be your identical twin and daughter. Yes. Yeah. At the same time. Yeah. Now obviously it'd be your daughter because it would be a girl just like you because yeah. obviously it's exactly the same. Now, where this was first done was with Dolly the sheep. So Dolly was a transgenic sheep. But Dolly also had four legs and a tail. And Dolly was a transgenic sheep who had a human gene inserted into them. Okay. So this was a human gene which made a human protein, and the protein was made in the milk. Okay. Yeah. Yes? So rather than um, go through sexual reproduction with... with um, but actually, no, it wasn't Dolly. It was Tracy. So Tracy was oh. the mum and Dolly is the clone. Yeah. Yep. So you can't really, do you say that Tracy's the mum? You say it's the clone sister? Yeah. Yes? Your yeah. clone friend? Mm. Okay, so they again, what they did was they took um, a cell, I think it was from a mammary gland, but it's irrelevant, it's just yeah. any somatic cell. Um, and then they put that into an egg, yeah. gave it a zap of electricity, so, so Put it, put it into a surrogate sheep. Yeah. And then nine months, well not my nine months, I don't know what gestation <laughs> time is for sheep, probably about four months um, later, they give birth to Dolly, who was a, tra uh, who was a clone of Tracy. Um, and it's genetically identical so that the clone then produces the um, transgenic protein that was introduced into Tracy. Yeah. Now the issues with this is that you're allowed to, you can, well, what's the way to put it? You can only clone um, somatic cells um, and but you don't know really the age of the clone. Yeah. So how old is the clone is always the question that's asked. The and are there there are there health defects that result yeah. from this? Okay? Yeah. Good. Uh, and that's nuclear transfer. Um <laughs>